Japan, we're heading out to give Steph a hand with his Outlander. We went over actually last night and tore into it. Um, he's got high kilometers on this bike. It's a 2019 Outlander XMR 650. And it's got 8,500 kilometers on it, I believe. So it's been uh, well used. It's been a great bike for him. And uh, I think he's had basically just minor maintenance. The upper steering bushing is completely slopped out there is so much room in the bars that it's it's kind of at this point it's a risk it's a little bit dangerous so uh he decided to go the full mile he replaced the pitman with the uh, j parts upgraded double pinching more aggressive spline so i did the upgrade a while back if you guys remember on my uh my renegade uh, we replaced the shaft totally we went a little bit further and got the j parts uh, steering shaft which had double pinch and more aggressive spline on it as well so um, my Renegade super low kilometers like 2,000 kilometers on my old steering stem So I brought it just in case and sure as shit With this one and if you look close enough This is worn right You will yeah. see there's a lot more room in those mm. splines for it to go back and forth And these are still just quite a bit sharper right and that's mm. obvious because you got a lot less wear on it So this one's gonna be the one going in the bike gonna be nice and fresh and tight Steph's gonna be pretty stoked so it's in much better shape and uh, with the fresh bushing up top I assume that uh, and a J parts bushing at that it's definitely a little more robust and, and uh, better quality than the stock bushing that comes in them so I expect you'll get a little uh, higher life out of it but uh, you should be good to go for another well probably the, the time frame or duration that he owns this bike anyway so that's where we're at we're on our way out to Steph's garage right now to kind of button up the Outlander we took it completely apart last night Pretty well buttoned up. We're going I actually did it pretty quick, maybe half an hour, 30 minutes. We actually went together nicely, and I'll tell you right now, it saved the day. Look at that guy. Thank you very much, Bridget, because that thing saved the day. I'd have been an hour with those two bolts. And that thing had it done in minutes. They already had the Pitman arm on before I got the call to. Hey, uh, you won't mind come giving us a hand. This kick ass, man. We're gonna go try this shit out. So, uh, stay tuned. We'll hit the trail and see how stuff steering is. But yeah, so, going to pick up Spaz. He sold his Polaris and it was high kilometers as well. I believe it was 2019 as well. And, uh, anyways, the 850 Sportsman's gone, boys. And the new arrival has, has come. So, I think he's gonna throw his bike in the trailer. If we can get Steph's bike fixed in a timely manner, then we may unload the bikes and go for a little bit of a test rep, see how it works. And let's see what he has got to replace the old sportsman. We should probably load your bike, don't you think? Well, yeah, I definitely want to take a look at it. Well, that's what I thought we were doing, no? Well, no, hold on. If you're not bringing the bike, we, we would definitely want to take a look at it. Let's go take a look at it. I missed you too. Holy crap, crap. I'm quite the bone. Stay a bone. Holy crap, look at your bone. Look at that, eh? Brand new to one. Look at those lights. That looks pretty sharp, man. There is a new face on this baby. A new suspension. Okay, so. Show so the 850. Showa? Oh, yeah. Yes, 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 I recognize them. That is new. Nice bike, bud. Holy shit, you aren't kidding. You really haven't got it very dirty. She looks awesome. Desert sand, basically. It's like, come on now. It's awesome. Oh, yeah. Well, were you washing something? You got a pile of water under there. So, good job, bud. Wow, what a nice bike. Woo! And your first impressions, you've had a couple rides on it, got 100 kilometers on it already. I love it. Okay. Versus uh, the player suspension, you find this suspension. I sit down on it more than I was standing up. Yeah. I think I found the other one I was standing up a lot. Yeah. You know I mean? like, a yep. lot. Absorbing all that with your body. But this one here, it's just unbelievable. So you've added the risers here. Right? That was the addition out of the factory, and you're getting yourself a plow. And what yeah. more do you really need other than uh, twelve thousand dollars worth of add-ons? <laughs> Happy birthday to me! This bike is awesome, bud.
Yeah, that looks badass. See what the suspension actually fucking feels like. Oh, look at all the water goes out. It stays dry, you don't even need waders. Super impressed with the suspension. It's weird because it's so square, it feels weird as it really slides and stays really flat through it. You almost feel like you want to dig in. No, not with this one. Yeah. It's very, very tight. But uh, ah, I'm blown away. It's great. The suspension is night and day. Isn't it though? Wait, it is unreal. That's what I mean. I can sit down on it. I'm like, oh my god! Like, like acceleration's good. I was almost full bar across there when I went out and come back. Almost. <laughs> Feels good. Feels great. I'm so impressed with the suspension though. Yeah, me too. And how yeah. Oh, it handles great. Like, yeah, and I just popped the front a couple times, see how it deals with the weight of the bike, and it's like no problem. Not even close to bottom. Super nice. Yeah man. It is a beautiful bike, man. It's a gorgeous bike and it works awesome. I'm super impressed. The suspension, I am. Yeah, I'm impressed too, Joe. Middle water wheelie, no problem. That's not deep water. That's only up to here, so yeah. you're not even using float. That's just straight power. Works freaking awesome.
I'm just kind of taking it in, bud. It's a lot to take in. It's a super sharp bike. It is. But is the muffler. You'd like something a little bit more spicy? Like yours. Well, no, not like mine. I got the large core. Mine is next step to a, a straight pipe. It's a straight pipe with a baffle in it. You know what I mean? Like it's 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 high performance pipe, that one. I don't think you need something that loud, to be honest with you, Spaz. I'd rather not follow my pipe. <laughs> Let's be honest, I love the pipe. I'd rather not follow it, though. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. No, it sounds awesome. This bike's great, man. Congratulations. This looks awesome. Thanks, buddy. Yep. Yeah. Freaking right, can't wait to get out.